welcome back. Today's video is going to be another exciting one because I am going to be showing you guys what is in my ginormous bag. So here I have a Michael Kors something. I don't know what it's called. I got it a very long time. Well, not really a long time ago. About a year ago. Um, my fiance bought it for me. It's just like this. It's gold and it has like beach bag bottom. Then it has feet on the bottom and it's just extremely large and it has a long strap for a crossbody. I haven't really been in my purse in quite some time because as y'all know I'm a new mom so basically my purse is my diaper bag. I just throw anything I need in there and just go. I don't have time to be lugging around this huge thing anymore so <laughs> I just use my diaper bag. But let's just jump into it. I'm going to pull out everything and anything that is in here even though I don't really remember what is in here. It's been quite some time you guys like I'm not even kidding it's been like maybe since I had the baby that I've been in this I don't even know but right, let's just jump into the video y'all on the inside of this bag there's like two tiny pockets and we're just gonna start from there and this is in the front part see if you can see inside there's two there, and then there's two there, which I can't really show you because um, this bag is large. Starting in this first tiny packet in the side, I have like paper. What? These like pay stubs and like a Burger King um, <laughs> coupon. I have another pay stub. I have this Marc Jacobs. I think I sprayed Daisy on it, but doesn't have sent anymore obviously that was years ago now we have an appointment card for when I was going to see the sonogram person when I was pregnant we have more papers about stuff this probably needs to get out of there because I don't even know what this is let's see what else is in that pocket nothing else in that pocket in the next one I have a Bath and Body sanitizer fresh strawberry scent. I have these in probably every purse that I own. I have it in my diaper bag, I have it in my little Michael Kors purse, I have one in this one, I think I have one in my car. So I really like these, I have these everywhere. And I have a little earring. <laughs> just one, not the other one, just one earring. Now I'm going to go into the other side where the zipper pocket is. Um, I have another pack of wet ones that are probably dry. They're probably dry ones now. <laughs> just kidding. Yeah, they're actually still wet. Oh my god, that's amazing. I've had these in here for like two years <laughs> and they're still wet. So guys, definitely get you a travel pack of wet ones. They will last you two years. <laughs> in the next pocket, I have Zyrtex because I am allergic to everything. <laughs> my allergies do get really bad. So I bought these, but I don't think I ever took one and they've been in this purse for a very long time. Let's just put it like that. Okay, moving on into the next pocket I just have prenatals that I never took because they made me puke when I was pregnant so never took those I'm moving into the big section in the purse which is just like the middle section where all the juicy stuff is I guess first I have this little uh, bag from Victoria's Secret I think my mom bought me this it's just cute it's pink and white stripe I really like this this is so cute it's just going to waste in here it has a little rose gold detailing rose gold zipper inside I have rosebud salve I don't really like it because I don't like the smell of roses so I kind of just wasted money on this I thought it was going to be good but um no I just like my menthol lip shine better than this this sucks I have another Purell hand sanitizer NARS Recugin I don't even know how to say it but this is probably one of my favorite lip colors ever guys this is amazing but I got it as a sample for my birthday I'm actually gonna Oh yeah, love this. Next I have a cargo lip gloss. And it's just a sheer pinky lip gloss that I did like to keep on hand, I guess, but I don't even carry this purse anymore. Next I have a Nivea lip butter in the vanilla and macadamia kiss. Oh my gosh, I used to be obsessed with this. Um, but I don't know, I just found other products and I stopped using it. Really moisturizing, smelled really good, tasted really good, loved it. Next I have a Lipstick from Maybelline. This is from the Buffs collection, I think, in the shade Truffle Tease. 
really nice nude for everyday wear. And then lastly, I have Versace's Bright Crystal. It's a little sample I got from Sephora. I really love this, and I really do want to get the full size. It smells so good, guys. Like, oh my god, it just smells so good. I really like that perfume. It's awesome. So next, I have a full bottle, guys. A full bottle of A Thousand Wishes by Bath & Body Works. Um, I think I have a lotion in here, too, unless I took it out and used it. But I do have the full bottle of this in my purse for some reason. For some reason. I don't know. And I also have the travel size. So that's cool. I'll never run out of perfume ever in my life. Next, I have my ancient prenatal vitamins that I stopped taking when I was seven months pregnant. And then I have this glasses case that I got off Amazon, and inside I just have these sunnies that I don't wear anymore because I need to get contacts. So, yeah. Then I have this old Victoria's Secret Rewards card. It's probably expired. This is so old. This is, like, from spring. Next, I have my change purse from Victoria's Secret. I think it's just full of pennies. Yeah, it's full of pennies. Another hand sanitizer from Pura. I'm not going to take it out because it's on this little hook thing for your keys. So that's that. And then I have the matching travel size lotion for a thousand wishes. And then I have a ballpoint pen. And a business card from Timothy H. from T-Mobile. Shout out to you. Now I have a stamp. Did these go bad? No, right? I should definitely keep this. I definitely probably need it. That is it for my bag. It is completely empty now. I've shown you everything that is in this bottomless bag. I feel like Hermione when she had that purse that just had everything in it. A tent, a wand, everything, girl. And it was like this big. That was awesome. That is everything that is in my purse. I hope you enjoyed this video. I definitely enjoyed making it because I haven't been in my purse in so long. But please give this video a thumbs up if you did enjoy it and subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next video.